brushes that swing in and uh, they sterilize and stimulate each teeth for about six seconds. There's a little car wash going on down there. And when they go in, do they have feed or something that they yeah. eat or munch on there's while a, they're there? Yeah, there's a feed pan up in front. So because the robot knows which cow it is, it knows how much milk she gives, so it knows appropriately how much pellets to give to each cow. It also knows how long it takes for each cow to milk, so at variable speed trickles them out to her the entire time she's standing there to get them okay. keeps her content. So the lasers came on, they identify the distance and location to each of the four teats, and it puts it on one at a time. So the data that we're collecting uh, is not only milk weight, but milk temperature, milk color, and conductivity. It tells us the uh, quality of the milk. And the data pops up on that screen right there? It's there. It's also on our computer in the office. Okay. Yeah. It looks like you have a timer, so it will run at a probably a maximum of six minutes. Does nope. it? It tells her normal milk time is six minutes oh, twenty gotcha. seconds. That's her progress. Okay. Based on her average. All right. It's just timing her. And I'm she guessing it's got an automatic turn off. So based on milk flow, each quarter mm -hmm. will come off one at a time when each quarter gets done. Okay. So you're never over milking the other three quarters to uh, get the last from the last part of and what would you, what would you say is probably the average milk time for all your cows um, if you're the guess I think we're well the average box time I can tell you for sure is about six and a half minutes from the time the cow steps in gets prepped gets milk gets post up and walks out it's between six and a half and seven minutes So what we're seeing here is one one of the teats isn't giving as much milk as maybe the other looks like. Well, right. Uh, normally the front quarters milk out before the back because they are smaller and they yeah. give, give less milk. So uh, th that quarter has detached now and it's just milking out the other quarters uh, until they're done. So now there's only one left. Attaches the final one. It sprays on post dip, which kills bacteria until the next time that she milks. And it goes back to the wash position and sanitizes itself in between every cup. Now the feed pan swings open. She'll log out. And the robot is ready for the next cow to milk.